Last night, as America really did for a moment seem on the brink of war with Iran, some users on Twitter voiced their displeasure by tweeting the hashtag, I voted for Hillary. It was a nice little rhetorical win until Hillary Clinton herself had to join in. The message, of course, is that President Hillary would not be starting a war with Iran. But is that true? Or would Hillary Clinton be maybe the single most likely person in the history of America to start a war with Iran? Remember, as Secretary of State, she bragged about overthrowing Muammar Gaddafi in Libya. How'd that work? Well, they're, they're now selling slaves in downtown Tripoli. Watch. That is the land of unconfirmed <laughs> Yes, we came. We saw, he died. <laughs> did it have anything to do with your visit? No, I'm, I'm sure it did. Oh, 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 oh. we killed him. Oh, killing people's hilarious, especially when their countries fall apart and slave markets open. Anyway, if anything, Hillary Clinton's intentions toward Iran were even more bloodthirsty. In 2008, which was a long time ago, the first time she was running for president, she warned that Iran had better be ready because she was going to crush them. If Iran were to launch a nuclear attack on Israel, what would our response be? And I want the Iranians to know that if I'm the president, we will attack Iran. Whatever stage of development they might be in their nuclear weapons program in the next 10 years, during which they might foolishly consider launching an attack on Israel, we would be able to totally obliterate them. Yeah, so just in case you didn't remember that Hillary Clinton was the ur-neocon, because she was and is, there you go. One person who may remember is Congresswoman.